what I already had was green tea. Um, if you go to the 100 yen store and you see a whole bunch of tea, usually it's it's written in English what kind of tea it is, but in case it's not, uh, just look for this kanji, uh, these kanji right here. Um, this is the kanji for green, I believe, and this is the kanji for tea, so this is green tea. Um, green tea is just helpful. I mean, if you don't like it, you can try to find some other kind of tea, but green tea is just simple to make since, you know, you're not really supposed to put sugar or anything in it. You can just, you know, put a tea bag in or however you prefer to make green tea. Um, you just, you can just make it and drink it and you can make it any strength you like. So I already had some green tea, so I had a lot of that. Um, I also had some lemon tea. Uh, I bought the lemon tea uh, just to have something else to drink. And um, this is good, especially with honey. Uh, you want to get honey because in case you have a, a sore throat, um, the honey can help soothe the throat. So you can, instead of putting sugar in the lemon tea, you can put some honey in it instead. So I got some lemon tea as well. Um, another drink that I got was this right here and it says uh, Hachimitsu lemon and um, Hachimitsu is honey uh, lemon is obviously lemon and uh, this drink is also good for colds um, because the you've got the acidity of the lemon and then you've got the sweetness of the honey and this is really good for colds and this one uh, you can use it for hot drinks or cold drinks and the directions are on the back right here but um, these are pretty useful. You can also find these at the 100 yen store. Right here. Um, this is miso soup, instant miso soup. And you can usually find this at the 100 yen store, depending on which one you go to. Um, but if you can't, uh, just check your grocery store. They'll sell uh, packs of miso, 8-pack, uh, 10-pack, 12-pack, uh, and it's really cheap. Uh, the grocery stores that I go to sell them for only 88 yen, which is really cheap, and uh, one pack is for one serving. And the thing I like about miso is, um, I personally like miso, I know people who don't like it, but uh, I like miso, and um, whenever my throat is sore, my mom would tell me, oh, just gargle some salt water, and I hate gargling salt water. So instead of doing that, I just have miso, because miso soup is really salty. And, you know, like I said, I like it. So this is another thing that I um, use to help with whenever I have colds uh, and sore throats and things like that. So enough with the drinks. Um, moving on to candy. Now, it once again, at the 100 yen store, they have a pretty large section of, uh, of hard candy. And um, in Japanese... Uh, they actually call it throat candy. It's like nodo amet. Nodo is throat. And basically because it's candy that you suck on. And so the kind that I usually buy when I have colds, one is this one. Uh, if you can't see it, it says uh, super minto. And this is just mint candy. And this is to kind of clear out my stuffy nose. And uh, they come in these pretty big bags. Um, I'm not really sure how many... I have to say maybe about 30 or 40 candies in a bag. So I usually have these to clear my throat because the mint is pretty strong. So these help clear my stuffy nose. Another one is um, Hachimitsu lemon candy. Um, there's actually a specific kind of candy, uh, Hachimitsu lemon candy, that I like. But um, I bought that back when I was living in Tokyo and I haven't found it at another store. But um, that's the one that I really like. But these are useful for if you have a sore throat because it has, uh, just like the drink, it has honey and lemon in it. The other one, um, also kind of good for the throat and good for when you have colds, they sell a lot of um, lemon flavored vitamin C candy. And um, so I, use, I have a lot of these. I've bought three different kinds so far. Um, just to kind of experiment with, they, you know, they all taste different. And um, but look for these um, if you 
need vitamin C and you want something that tastes really good, um, you can just take these. Uh, they usually come in lemon flavor, but they also have other flavors too. Uh, moving on, um, if you find yourself um, low on tissues, they have those at the 100 yen store as well. Um, one thing you should always keep with you, whether you have a cold or not, uh, one thing you should always keep with you is pocket tissue. Um, and it comes in handy for random uses. So uh, I bought a big pack of these uh, when I first got here. And so, um, you know, I move around between different classrooms a lot uh, at one of my schools. So I always keep one of these in my back pocket um, or, you know, so that I can just take it with me whenever I need it to blow my nose or something like that. Um, as you can see, this mask here, I can actually take this off. Um, this mask here, uh, if you can't tell, is a cold mask. And they come in, in different shapes. Um, you have these disposable ones, which are made of kind of a, a papery, almost gauzy material. These are, these are disposable ones. They come in uh, multi-packs. I bought one that was like a 14-pack. And um, uh, they also have cloth masks, which uh, you can wash. So I usually don't get those just because I don't feel like having to wash a mask all the time. So I usually just get the disposable ones. Um, and they really help because not only does it keep um, it, not only does it keep you from spreading germs to other people, but when you breathe in, um, the air is kind of warmed for you. So it kind of it. To an extent, it helps you clear your sinuses, so these are really helpful. Um, another thing that I that is useful um, are bath salts, and um, the the bath salts at the 100 yen store they have different kinds uh, with different kind of herbs and um, I don't want to use the word additives, but they they add different things in it. Um, one of them is uh, collagen, and the other one is um, aloe extract, uh, another one that I can't even pronounce, uh, but they have all kinds of different things in it, and this one has uh, aloe extract in it, but I have other kinds too. And um, the bath salts are good uh, if you're familiar with the Japanese style of bathing, uh, you know, you take a shower and then you um, sit in a hot bath for a couple of minutes. And um, that's, of course, really, really useful uh, when you have a cold. So I did that for the past two nights. I'm not going to do it tonight because I'm starting to feel better. Um, but it was it was pretty helpful uh, the past two nights when I used the bath salts. Uh, so that's pretty much it. Um, if you uh, have any questions, of course, you can always respond to the video or um, visit my blog and ask. Um, I haven't cleared up what the cause of um, this was. It could be allergies because I've started to develop um, kind of a, a rash on, on my arms and they itch like mosquito bites. And so I'm thinking it might have been an allergic reaction to a medicine that I took. Uh, so, but hopefully it'll clear up. Um, I just know that being here um, has not made me uh, the most physically fit, but, uh, you know, I'm willing to go through it. And, yeah, I'll be okay. So anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.